Tomorrow night, we should know which Democrat will go up against Governor Ron DeSantis in November. The primary is between Congressman Charlie Crist and Ag Commissioner Nikki Freed. Both are including the Bay Area in their final campaign push. ABC Action News reporter Eric Waxler joining us live in St. Pete with the very latest. Eric. Yeah, hello there. We're at the Manhattan Casino in St. Petersburg. Charlie Crist, the congressman, will be here within the hour for a final get out the vote rally. Not only has Charlie Crist and Nikki Fried been campaigning against each other, but they've both been really campaigning hard about their ability to beat Ron DeSantis. Ag Commissioner Nikki Fried rolled through Tampa today as she travels around the state trying to reach any voters still undecided on who the Democratic nominee for governor will be. I'm not a 30 year career politician, but people don't want that. People want a fresh perspective. They want new ideas and they're ready for something new. Freed says the most important issues right now are Florida's affordable housing problems and the fight for a woman's right to choose. She also referred to the governor as a dictator. We all know that Donald Trump is the greatest threat to our national security, but Ron DeSantis is our greatest threat to democracy. Both Freed and Charlie Crist have been extremely critical of Governor DeSantis and both say they are the Democrats' best chance to get him out of office in November. Democrats are frustrated and Democrats are angry uh, and they're being put upon. You know, the other party talks about don't tread on me a lot. Well, Florida's been tread upon by Ron DeSantis. LGBTQ, women, African-Americans, people of color generally, across the board, public education, the environment, I mean, you name it, uh, you know, we don't have a governor that's focused on our beautiful Florida. And Charlie Crist will be here in his home turf of St. Petersburg for a watch party tomorrow night on Election Day. Meanwhile, Nikki Fried tells me she's going to be in Tallahassee in the morning to vote and then has to take part in an unusual Election Day cabinet meeting called by Governor Ron DeSantis. And then she will make her way down to South Florida. Live in St. Petersburg, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News. Eric, thank you. In a week after a poll from the University of North Florida gave Nikki Fried the lead, a new poll from FloridaPolitics.com paints a much different picture. It says Representative Charlie Crist leads by nearly 30 percent among likely Democratic voters. We will find out tomorrow night. The winner will face Governor Ron DeSantis in November.